Blessings, Lafayette family and Facebook friends. My daily message for Tuesday, September 20th. And I remind you that lots of great stuff is at fountainchurchtallahassee.org. And join us every Sunday in this beautiful sanctuary for worship at 1030 a.m. Or worship with us virtually or by drive-up worship. My scripture today is Psalm 145, verse 4. One generation shall commend your works to another and shall declare your mighty acts. This is the word of the Lord. The reason I shared this particular scripture is that I read a very thoughtful essay the other day, and it was titled, What Will Be the Legacy of Humanity? Now, it was not written from a Christian perspective, but I will certainly interject my faith into the discussion. But the question was, dinosaurs dominated the earth for many more years than human beings have even been around. But what is their legacy? Well, their legacy is only found in the fossil record. What will become of us? What will be our legacy? Will someday they say about us, they conquered poverty, they conquered war, they conquered chaos and conflict, they were able to elevate life so that it was a joy to be living, and they were able to extend those blessings across their population. Is that what they're going to say? Or are they going to say their very self-centered and aggressive behaviors led to countless wars and conflicts and deep inequities, and eventually they destroyed themselves? Or will it be somewhere in between? Now, first I want to say that I know that our fate as human beings is in the hands of the Lord. And so that no matter how badly we serve as stewards, by faith we will be redeemed. I understand all of that, but it's still a good question to ask because are we here just to reap the benefits of this planet, use it up and be gone? Or are we here to enhance all life, to be good stewards of all creation, to avoid the kind of conflicts that are generated by poverty or rivalries or chaos or political intrigue. Well, I pray that the legacy we leave will be a legacy of love and a legacy of faith. What are your hopes and dreams? Share them with me. And let's share together our faith in the God who has us in his hands. Let us pray. Lord, we thank you that we are your children. We thank you that our eternity is assured by your promises in Jesus Christ. But we still want to leave a better legacy on this planet than we have earned to this point. Lead us and guide us to be more as though we were already citizens of your earthly kingdom, because we are. Let's strive to transform it in Jesus' name. Amen. Grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ.